let me tell you the process. I'm trying to take my gloves off, buckle my pants, take down my four layers just to be able to squat over a pit toilet without freezing my butt off. Winter camping life. <laughs> the coffee, the water is boiling over. You just left. Oh, you're eating. What are you eating? It's a beef stick that I had to put over here to warm it up so that it wasn't frozen. Welcome back to our winter camping adventures. We are at Devil's Lake State Park. It's minus, it's supposed to be minus eight tonight, but no wind. Devil's Lake State Park, one of the bu busiest state parks in Wisconsin. You can really only get in here in the winter unless you reserve your spot a year in advance. It's almost impossible to get here in the summer. There's one other camper out here with us. So it's a little warmer than our adventures last week when we were at the negative 36 uh, wind chill. But we got a good fire going. It's freaking hit. What are you cooking? Mushroom burgers. She's hangry because she's cold. <laughs> it's night number three of this. Uh, I, I don't think you can see it, but Jack's gonna Jack's hanging in the rooftop tent tonight. We got the Mr. Buddy up there warming it up. He's got his two sleeping bags, so there's no good spot to put up the hot tent out here. Devil's Lake also has a train go by. You can hear it. Wow, we're just getting some dinner. We got in a little bit late. It was like six o'clock. Easy night burgers, and then uh, we'll get up in the morning. Should be clear skies, and tomorrow's to see. A little warmer so we can do a little fly around devil's lake's really neat a lot of there's some rock climbing areas some really great hikes yeah that's the train remember there's train tracks <laughs> well it's not the cold then it's a train 
Hey, there's people that live by trains. Yeah, but we don't live by a train. Ah, it'll be okay. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that'll be wonderful. <laughs> well, alrighty then. I really hope that's a one time tonight. It's a probably not. Jack's just hanging out in the truck right now, eating his dinner. Because it's extra warm up in there, just leaving it running. I'm gonna pour me a beverage and try to get warm. Oh, look who's awake. Seriously. Good morning, guys. I'm gonna attempt to put my shoes on. Was my phone in there? Yes. So, beautiful sunrise coming up behind us. <sighs> At Devil's Lake State Park. <sighs> it's currently 2 degrees and a wind chill of minus 14. Sweet. So I got the fire going. We got the truck running to warm it up inside. Soon. Sit in there and get a little refuge. Yes, after I run to the bathroom. Most importantly, though, we need the coffee. I already got the put the water on for the coffee. You should just. I think this is already boiling. Okay, I got to pee. Come on, man! I need some coffee. Pardon the mess back here, but you can't wash any dishes because it's so cold. I had to put the windshield up because it's a little bit windy this morning. Oh, I'm going to turn this down, I guess. Luckily, we're right by the pit toilet, so it's not far. Uh, wasn't too bad. Inside, I think we got up to like 40, 40-ish, I'd say. There's still frost in here, though, if you can look, see it. Forty-two inside here. We got it pretty warm with our body heat. And now we're just trying to get some. We're probably gonna. This is just an overnight trip. We're gonna do a little flying, try to fly the drone, and um, have a little breakfast and hit the road. Oof, so cold. Got our portable fire. Pit, which is great, love it. Fireside Outdoors pop up pit. I think it's about a hundred dollars on Amazon. We really love our Oz Tent King Coda chairs, really nice and bulky. They're a little bit bigger when you fold them up and put them in the case, but they're great chairs. Uh, I think they're around 119. Really beefy and sturdy. They're not gonna, they don't fall apart or anything. We've had them about almost a year. We got little side pouches for, oof, that wound. Little side pouches for uh, cups and phones. There's a zipper pouch back here in the headrest if you wanna like add up. I guess they say you can put a shirt or some clothing in there and make it more padded for like a headrest. It almost kind of leans back when you're in it. Oz Tent, King Coda. Oh, there's our favorite coffee. Absolutely delicious. Blackout Coffee Company, I'll put the link below you can get a 10% discount it's an affiliate link so it helps us out just a tiny bit if you want to support the channel uh, they got tons of great flavors um, they're based in Florida really good people 
Yeah, similar in name to Black Rifle, but they're not trying to be Black Rifle or anything like that. Um, they support veterans. So. We're not going to show you a lot of our kitchen, because let me tell you. Yeah, I already mentioned that. It's fine. It's anything, any bit of water, anything, it, everything freezes, and it's a hot mess. Yeah, the spilled water back here just freezes instantly. It's, we made bird burgers last oh, night. Oh, wait, the coffee. Cold weather is just messing everything up. Feels wind. Last night when we got here, and during the night it was calm. There was no wind, so I think it went to like minus six, and no wind, so room chill minus six, which is way different. That's like summertime compared to our minus thirty-six that we were in last week. Winter camping is not too bad as long as you're prepared. There's a few things to deal with though, like keeping the water from freezing when you need water to boil. Kinda. Face is a little cold, but not that bad. So he slept warm in his bags up in the free spirit tent. Minus six. She's back here. <clears throat> Cooking a little bit of bacon and sausage bacon strips just for a snack. We're probably gonna go find breakfast. But I gotta warm my hands. I go. Take five. Take two. <laughs> well, we had another great trip. A little quick overnighter at Devil's Lake State Park. More extreme winter camping. It was cold, but it's not as bad as last week when at the negative 36 wind chill. We had a good time. Devil's Lake's really neat. It's great to come in the summer if you can get a reservation, but it's probably the number one or number two busiest state parks in Wisconsin. So you better already be with me. Or just come or in the winter. Come in the winter. <coughs> Where there's literally only two people. We hope you had a good time with us. Uh, we really appreciate the support. Uh, we'll be out again soon. If you like the video, hit like. like, follow, share. Please subscribe. We really need more subscribers. We're trying to Keep sharing our adventures. We have many more places to go. Our calendar is booked. And we enjoy bringing you guys along, so continue to follow us. We'll see you next time. See you soon. <laughs>